Hello everyone, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we are going to learn how to reduce the Excel file size. If the file size is huge, then you will face problem while opening it, while working on it and while sending it. And in today's video, we will see how to shrink the file size. Here we have a sample file whose size is 9568 KB. Let's open this file now. If you now glance over the data in the file, if you see column G, the cells are colored based on the credit card type. And if I go back to column D now, the full name is nothing but the combination of first name and last name. And we have derived full name by using a formula text join. So if you want to reduce the file size, you will have to remove all the unnecessary color formatting. And if you think you can remove the formula and do a paste special of values, Please do so. Now let's remove all this color coding. Select all. Go to home. Go to color. Click no fill. And then go back to column D. Select the whole column. Copy and do paste special values. Alright. Now let me save it. And go back and check if the file size is reduced. You can see the file size is reduced to 5886 KB. Right. Let's go back again to our sample and just check for the data area now. Press Ctrl Home to see the first active cell and Ctrl End to check the last active cell. If you check now, last active cell extends up to 1 million rows. But we really do not have that much data, right? So what we do now is, since we know there is no data after column H, delete them. The same exercise we are going to do for rows as well. Select all the rows till down and delete. Now if I press Ctrl End, then it will show me it's 14,594 through, not the million through. Let's go back and check what impact it has made. If you see now, the file size is reduced to 725 KB, right? A great reduction, right? Let's go back again and resave the file in a different format. For that, go to File, click Save As. I'll say Sample File Version 2. Now, instead of Excel Workbook, I will select Excel Binary Workbook option. Hit Save. Now, if I go back to the folder and check, the file size is reduced to 419 KB. It was around 9500 KB when we started and now it is 419 KB. That's how you can reduce the file size. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you like the content of the video, hit the like button, share the videos and subscribe to my channel to know more and more such interesting facts. Until my next video, happy learning.